about 12 years ago when my son was born, I had to take on a job. Uh, that's when I always tell people I had to become a man. I have mouths to feed. Uh, so I was forced to take this job that I was not interested in. I hated it, uh, but I knew it was going to make me enough money to, to survive. Every day I would go to work saying I hate my job, I just want to find something else to do, I need a career path, um, and I was just lost. I was very young at the time. Um, after being there for a short period of time, there was a new employee that came along. He had said to me, you know, if you, if you had to work only for fun, and you, you just wanted to work for fun, you do something you're passionate about, you didn't care about the money, you didn't need the money, you were just going to go to work every day just because you loved what you did, and just to go have fun at work, what, what would you do? And immediately I knew exactly what I wanted to do. I said I would 100% be in the fitness industry, wellness industry, health wellness, something along those lines. Following the advice of my coworker, I immediately started to pursue my fitness career. I knew to be taken seriously in the fitness industry, you had to have a good physique. Um, I was always pretty serious about my nutrition and exercise, but at this point I took it to a whole nother level. Um, I quickly became very successful in the fitness industry, competing in the fitness competitions. Um, I became Mr. USA in 2011. Um, from there, that led me into my successful fitness modeling career. I was featured in Muscle and Fitness Magazine a few times and different magazines around the world. Carlton was pointed in my direction uh, in the gym. He had asked around for a coach uh, that could get him ready for a fitness competition that he had on his bucket list. Carlton and I started working together, and as we started working together, we became closer and started throwing ideas off of each other. Uh, we both had some ideas to create this wellness company. Um, it was really selfishly to, uh, to create a company that would, uh, that would offer products uh, and services that we would both want to use ourselves. Uh, and that's basically how Forever Young was born. amazing medical staff that Carlton and I have been able to put together at Forever Young, we are transforming lives in a whole different way. Our patients are living the Forever Young lifestyle. And what that means is they're eating better, they're exercising, they're taking their vitamins, they're doing blood work, they're optimizing their health and maintaining that optimization. So what I've realized now is that my passion really is not only health and wellness, but really just helping people. Uh, that, that feeling of, of a patient or a client being so happy with the results and saying how much better they feel or how much better they look. It, there's just no feeling like that um, to, to, to be able to be a part of that and say I had something to do with this patient or this client's success. I'm a very self-motivated person. I'm very competitive. I'm a very goal-oriented person. When I set goals, my goal is to always exceed my goals. Um, in my earlier years in high school, I was a very successful cross-country runner. I was always setting new PRs for myself. I was a very successful wrestler. I was a district champion, regional champion, first team all county, top eight in the state. Now in business, I, I'm extremely competitive. Um, I never cut corners. I work very hard at what I do. Um, and one thing about me is when I'm passionate about something, I'm going to live, eat, and breathe it all day long. And that is the reason for my success. At Forever Young, we often get asked the question, how have you become so successful in such a short period of time? How have you exceeded your competition so quickly and it really just comes down to one thing at Forever Young that separates us from the rest, it's passion. 